In this tutorial, we're going to cover how to get a test tube set up for your queen. We're also going to take a look at my queen. So here I have the stuff you're going to need. You're going to need a test tube. I use the AC standard test tube I reviewed earlier. Um, water, I use bottled water or boiled water. I wouldn't recommend tap water, but you can. Two cotton balls and then something you can stick in. And I, in this case, I'm using um, a cotton stick. And then, of course, wash your hands. We need this to be a clean area. All right, the first thing you want to do is uh, fill your test tube up to the line that's marked on there um, with water. It's only marked on there for the AC test tube, so just kind of look where it's filled up to. More than halfway, but not too much. So once it's filled up to there, you're just, um, just going to want to stick your cotton in there next. So stick that in there. Take the pokey that you've got, and then you don't want to stick it in too slow because it'll create an air bubble. So pack it in there, and then kind of just squish it down, make sure it's all packed in, and wet too. Then you're going to want to take it and shake it like that so that it makes sure there's no water in there so your queen won't drown. Take your next cotton ball, uh, stick it in there just a little ways to create a uh, good sized chamber for her, and then uh, you're all good to go. Now for our current ant colony, um, or not really a colony yet, but this is the queen that I have. Um, there you can see her with a, a batch of eggs by her head. That's all she has as of right now. But hopefully they'll be hatching within the next month, and then I can keep you guys updated on her, uh, her first workers. As always, um, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe if you want to see more, and uh, yeah.